Hello everyone. So today we'll be taking Virasana Hero Pose. For that, you need to first stand on your knees. <clears throat> Just make sure you are rolling the thighs in. The thighs are getting that internal movement. And then at the same point of time, the back area of the leg, that is the down area, the shin bone area, the foot area needs to have that good opening. And then when you move it out, just make sure you are going to roll the calf muscle later. And then the ankle area needs to press down to the mat. The top of the foot area should be pressed down to the mat. Even the toes are pressed down to the mat. So whole shin bone region till the toe needs to press down to the mat firmly. And then same goes for the other leg. And then from there you are getting that lift in the sides of the trunk. Roll the shoulders, open up the chest. Very good. Now take your palm to the calf muscle. Good. Roll it nicely out. More roll it nicely out. Get that good movement. Good. And then drop the hip down onto the mat. Good. And make sure you are sitting on your sitting bones. You can take out the flesh out. Just check. Take out the flesh out from your palms. Good. The thighs are together. The knees are together. The shin bone going out. The foot going out. Again, I'll ask her to separate the toes from her fingers. Good. They should be opening in the toes. While you are going in Virasana, create the separation. And then just make sure the sternum is lifted. Make sure the chest is lifted. Take the fingertips back. Roll the shoulders. Do not arch your back. And then inhale Urdhva Hastasana arms. And release. Again, arm to the sides. And then just release. This was your Virasana, hero pose. So now there are a lot of people, those who cannot sit in Virasana. For them, you need a block or a bolster. So, first of all, what are you doing? You are standing on your knees. Again, let the legs be like that. Every position be like that. Only you are taking a block, place it exactly in between of the ankles and then drop the hip down, roll the calf muscle out and sit. Become more tall, use your fingertips and chest open, look forward. Virasana with the block. The next one, lift up. You'll be taking a bolster exactly in between of the ankle, foot, and then sit. Roll the calf muscle. Take the fingertips onto the backside. Now this will be challenging for the arms, for the palms to go down. You can use it on the bolster. Roll the shoulders, open chest, look straight. So there are different ways of doing Virasana by using a props. You can take a block, bolster, a cushion or a blanket. Depends on you what you have with you. And this is the way you will be doing Virasana with the help of props. This is one of the best way to learn the asana. Day by day with the regular practice, you will be removing the prop and you will be sitting directly on the ground, on the mat. Just to have a clarification, I just want to show you how the Virasana look from the back. Foot is out, hip is on the floor. So this is the final position of Virasana. Thank you everyone for watching this video. 
I hope you have understood how to do Virasana Hero Pose. And yes, do not forget to like, share and subscribe for upcoming new videos. Namaste.